hello, Ricebird Nation, and welcome to the May 2nd edition of Ricebird News. We'll start with some employee appreciation. Wednesday was Principals Day. We want to thank all the Ricebird principals for their leadership and commitment to students and staff. The instructional leaders include Mari Cooey at Myatt, Elizabeth Tupa at Hutchins, Samantha Wortham at Northside, Sandy Fellers at El Campo Middle School, and Paul Fleener at the high school. We commend each of the principals for their hard work, their commitment, and their dedication. On another note, tomorrow is School Lunch Hero Day. A special thanks goes out to our food service staff and their director for ensuring our students are nourished and fueled for their day. We appreciate everything you do. Tonight is the Education Appreciation Celebration at the Civic Center. The social begins at 5.30, followed by the awards at 6.45. Thank you to the Rotary Club of El Campo for hosting this evening to honor our faculty and staff. Around the district, the El Campo Middle School Junior Stars present two encore performances of You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown, this Thursday and Friday at 6 p.m. Admission is $5.00. Don't miss it. The ECMS musical always sells out fast. Get those tickets soon. Congratulations to Juliana Vasquez, who competed at the UIL regional meet in Corpus Christi, placing third. She is headed to Austin later this month to compete in the state persuasive speaking competition. The Pilot Club of El Campo presented our very own Barbara Lavati with the Texas District Special Education Teacher Award. Barbara is devoted to working with the Step 2 young adult students at El Campo High School, and she has been an invaluable resource for parents and students who need help in finding the right program, facility, and the resources as students transition from high school to contributing young adults. Barbara is an exemplary example of selflessness this attribute rubs off on our students. Way to go, Barbara. Myatt Elementary will be holding early registration for new and incoming pre-K and kindergarten students for the 24-25 school year. Dates include May 7th, May 8th, May 14th, May 15th, and May 20th. The hours of registration are between 4.30 and 6.00 each of those five days. Parents and guardians of our youngest rice birds, please check out our website for detailed information and what you will need to bring when you register your child. The Ladybird softball team is ready for round two of the playoffs after they swept Sweeney last week. The Ladybirds play Fredericksburg in a best two out of three series that begins tomorrow in Marion. Game one is Friday at 5 p.m. Game two on Saturday at 1 p.m. And a game three will follow game two if necessary, 30 minutes after the game two completion. Ricebird baseball has its first round of playoffs starting today against West Columbia with the first pitch at 7.30 in Palacios. For those of you getting ready for summer, Ricebird summer camps, sports summer camps, their registration is now open. The summer will, there will, this summer, there will be camps for youngsters interested in honing their skills in soccer, grades 5 through 9, that is next year's 5th through 9th graders, baseball, grades 5 through 9, softball, grades 5 through 9, basketball, grades 1 through 9, volleyball, also grades 1 through 9, and football, grades 3 through 9. Please check our athletic webpage for specific details for your children. And before we go, congratulations to Dean Painish on signing his letter of intent to play baseball at Hill College. That's all for now. Thanks for joining us. See you next week.